Today I'm going to replace the manual thermostats with some uh, digital programmable ones. First thing is to make sure you've turned the power off. Quite come off the way I wanted it. Alright, let me pull this out. Careful with the wiring. Again, you should consult with an electrician. Take the marrets off. Careful the wires, even though we have the breakers turned off. I still want to test them just to make sure that breakers are labeled correctly. Take the marrets off and with the meter test. There we go. That's what I want to see. Set on AC volts, we want zero. Now we know that breakers are shut off. Take this old one out. Now I've taken the cover off of this one. This is going to be the new programmable thermostat. Again, when you're looking for these, if you have electric heat like we do, you want to make sure you get the proper programmable thermostat for electric heat because they are different. So this is going to be going in its place. If you look inside, the old marrets are still in good shape. They're better than the ones that come with the thermostat. Inside there you'll see the, uh, the metal spring. I like to see those when I'm using the Marrettes. I don't like the ones with the plastic inside. These ones are of better quality. So, we've already tested. The breakers have been shut off. I tested it with the meter. So we have no power going to this. Get the Marrettes back on. I'm get these on nice and tight. mechanical and electrical connection. It's on there nice and tight. Okay, we'll get some marrets on. Both in place. Now we're going to tuck these wires back in. Be careful. You want to make sure your marrets are on there tight before you do this. Everything back in place, tucked inside. Two screws come with this new meter, so you want to get those screwed into the electrical, into the box. Everything straight, tighten these all the way up. Everything's nice and snug. There's a piece of plastic over this, just for display. And there we go. Pop the cover back on it. And that's how quick it is to replace a manual thermostat with a programmable energy efficient one. We're just waiting for the breaker to come back on to see if we can get some power here. The next step once you get the power on is to go through the manual that comes with the thermostat. You want to program it for your highs and your lows when you're in the house and when you're away. Every thermostat is different so the best bet is just to go through the book. As you can see now the breaker's on. Power's going to it so it'll have to be programmed from scratch. There we go.